drag pour on this small canvas. And uh, yeah, that will be it for today. So let me get the colors in her cup. Yeah, these are pretty colors that I got here. Trying to get more of the purple in there. This, uh, let's put some over here. And it's a flip cup. You know, flip cup drag pour. But with mini cups, you see? Mini tiny cups. Throw it there. And now what I do is I go across. Yeah. And just slightly. Don't lift it up too much. You might lose all your paint too fast. Yeah. That is beautiful. That turned out really pretty. Yeah, look at that. Nice colors, right? I love these colors. They're gorgeous. Okay, let's do another one. Uh, I think I have enough for just three lines. <laughs> so we'll see. And here we go. Smack again. Smack down. Yeah. Let me do it with this hand because this hand has a glove in it. Mm -hmm. Don't want to get too much paint on my hand uh, lately, today, anyway. There you go. That is so pretty. I love that. It's supposed to be a magenta, but it looks more like red to me. Yeah, looks more like a red. Mm -hmm. That's okay. I got more paint here that I could use. So the next one is going to be... This one is going to be, let's put more purple in it. I like the purple. No, let's do the, let's do more of the red or magenta or whatever color that is. I don't care what color really it is. I mean, sometimes these, you could just do the flip and then you could put the white around it, you know, just like a regular flip cup. And then you, you know, zigzag down the row. That's what I do anyway. I love this. I love doing these. These are good to do. They're fun. They're fun to do. Yeah. I messed up this last one, but it's okay. I could always fix it. Yeah, that looks good. It's beautiful. Just to make sure it is completely, uh, you know, covered here. Yeah. Let's do this. Push it back this way a little bit more. Yeah. Yeah. I could do a little one here in this corner just to use up the rest of this because I have a lot left over. Leftover paint. That's why I pour a little in this cup because I knew I was going to need just a little bit of paint. So here we go. Let's flip this one right here and throw a little white around it. Mm -hmm. Let's throw a little white around it, and uh, yeah, take it that way. Take it this way, and then take it that way. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, beautiful. There we go. Love it. Very pretty. Very pretty flip cup drag pour. It's one of my favorite flip cup drag pour. If you notice, I've done a lot of them. If you look at my pay playlist... You'll see I've done many, many, many flip cup drag pour because I do like them a lot. So, yeah. Let's, uh... Turned out really beautiful. And, uh, yeah, I love the way it came out, but I got to add a little bit of white paint in this area. There we go. And now what I'll do is I need a little bit more purple in this area here. So I'm just going to throw a little purple there. Um, since I got a little bald spot. So what I do is I'll do this to it. Mm-hmm. Some purple there. Mm -hmm. That's what leftover paint is all about. You gotta spread it out. Spread the love. Guys, yep. Spread the love. Mm -hmm. Alright. Let's say 
sure that looks good. The cells are gorgeous. Nice big, ginormous cells. Uh, beautiful cells creation there. Yeah, I made a few lines going up. And uh, yeah, I like to do these uh, flip cup drag core. They're very easy to do on these small little tiny shit that way. There we go. It's like a nose and a lip there and a chin in this corner. <laughs> yeah, looks like a nose, a chin, and the lips. Okay, we'll take that. And uh, just keep looking at all these beautiful colors that came out of that pour, a little bit of beautiful pour. I'm doing two at a time so you can look at these two now we'll move over to this one and the other one i gotta put more white here you see how the canvas looks a little purple here yeah i have to fix that that's not a problem though easy fix easy 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 fix so i hope you guys are enjoying this uh-huh nice beautiful slow movement so that you can capture every cell in the area i love these colors blended together so the colors i use with some magenta and a royal blue and a purple these are all from christina's paint christina walsh you can buy her paints very easy you can buy them with or without silicone and I like that I don't have to do the pouring medium myself anymore. I mean, I buy them without without silicone too, so I could put my own how much you know silicone I want in it. But if you want a lot, you buy the one that has silicone. And uh, yeah, you could get a little a lot. Love you guys. Have a wonderful, wonderful uh, rest of the week. I'll see you on Saturday. Hopefully, I'll get my resin by then. I have some ideas and some beautiful things coming your way. Love you. Bye.